with Ipswich already assured of a playoff place, Sunderland look to be the more hungry for goals at Portman Road in pursuit of that second automatic promotion spot into the Premiership. The prolific Kevin Phillips came closest to scoring in the opening exchanges. But perhaps sensing their opponent's frustration, Ipswich came back strongly in the closing minutes of the first half. Only Chris Makin's late challenge prevented Tariko's goal-bound shot. They weren't to be denied a second time though, and after the break, Matt Holland produced the goal that Sunderland had been dreading. They should have been level a few minutes later, but Phillips couldn't find the telling shot. And that automatic promotion spot looked to be drifting further out of Sunderland's reach when it's which David Johnson was brought down in the box. Only for Perez to save from Mathy. But it was only a temporary respite. Mathy made amends for the miss with a great strike to put the home side two up. Try as they might, Sunderland couldn't find a way past the Ipswich defence in the remaining minutes. Quinn and Daniel Dicchio both went close. But the result puts a real dent in Sunderland's hopes and means they could yet lose out to Charlton or Middlesbrough in the fight to follow the now-promoted Nottingham Forest into the Premiership.